The Iron Dream by Norman Spinrad is a novel within a novel that explores the themes of fascism, imperialism, and the nature of power. The novel is set in an alternative history where Adolf Hitler emigrated to the United States in 1919 and became a science fiction author instead of a dictator. The novel within the novel is called Lord of the Swastika, which tells the story of a human-like alien named Ferret Jaggar who rises to power in a brutal and violent world. At first glance, The Iron Dream appears to be a straightforward science fiction novel. However, the novel is actually a satire that exposes the dangers of fascist ideology. The novel within the novel, Lord of the Swastika, is an allegory for Hitler's rise to power in his fascist regime. Ferret Jaggar, the protagonist of Lord of the Swastika, is a power-hungry leader who uses violence and intimidation to gain control of his world. He represents the archetype of the fascist dictator who is willing to do whatever it takes to gain and maintain power. The novel within the novel is highly graphic and violent, with scenes of torture, murder, and genocide. However, this is precisely the point of Spinrad satire. By presenting these scenes in a science fiction context, Spinrad is able to highlight the absurdity and horror of fascist ideology. The violence and cruelty in Lord of the Swastika are not just the product of a fictional world, they are the logical conclusion of fascist ideology in the real world. The novel also explores the relationship between fascism and imperialism. Ferret Jagger's world is a highly stratified society, with the ruling class exploiting and oppressing the lower classes. The ruling class justifies their actions by claiming that they are bringing order and civilization to the world. This justification is similar to the rhetoric used by real-world imperialists, who claim that they were bringing progress and enlightenment to the peoples they colonized. Another theme in The Iron Dream is the nature of power. Ferret Jaggar is not content to simply rule his world, he wants to be a god. He desires absolute control over every aspect of his followers' lives, including their thoughts and beliefs. This desire for total power is a common feature of fascist regimes, which seek to control every aspect of society. Throughout the novel, Spinrad uses language and imagery to reinforce the themes of the novel. The language in Lord of the Swastika is highly charged, with frequent references to power, domination, and strength. The imagery is similarly intense, with scenes of mass rallies, militaristic parades, and grotesque displays of power. In conclusion, the Iron Dream is a powerful satire that exposes the dangers of fascist ideology. By presenting a fictional world where fascism is taken to its logical extreme, Spinrad is able to highlight the absurdity and horror of fascist ideology in the real world. The novel within the novel, Lord of the Swastika, is an allegory for Hitler's rise to power in his fascist regime. The novel explores the relationship between fascism and imperialism, as well as the nature of power. Through language and imagery, Spinrad reinforces the themes of the novel and creates a chilling portrayal of a world where fascist ideology is taken to its extreme.